Liverpool side. Virgil van Dijk plays alongside Joe Gomez at the back. Abby Keita plays with Jordan Henderson in midfield. And Roberto Firmino is the one striker. Now we can check on the Fulham lineup. Anthony Knockout starts. He was man of the match in his last game. And today it's just the one striker in the side. Going forward with real purpose now. One to chase down. He's gone over the defenders. Very good piece of work by the goalkeeper to turn that away from danger. Roberto missed with the chance to go into the lead now. That's the opening goal for Liverpool. Oh, they're happy with that. Why wouldn't they be? Highly skilled, very silky, easy on the eye. And that could easily go down as one of the team goals of the season. Beauty. Another angle on it here. It's not the easiest of managers to work for, I know that. And his players are doing what he demanded beforehand now. Incisive pass. And Tarigi. And in it goes towards the far post. And the goalkeeper very much on his game today. A really close, great technique there. Oh, there's no finer sight than when you get that right. Unlucky. Goalkeepers like action, there was plenty of action for him there. And now they've got a corner on the attack again, the team that's leading by one goal. Goalkeeper rising to the occasion, literally. Yeah, he would have been disappointed to get beaten, but nevertheless had to keep his eye on the ball. Swung in from the corner. Tried to keep it down, but couldn't quite manage it. Oh, I thought he was going to score there, I thought he should have scored. At the moment, it's looking quite good for Liverpool, but only quite good. They would have hoped to be in a stronger position, but it could be worse, of course. There's... Mitrovic! Oh, he's missed it, and that would have been the equaliser. Oh, what a chance. What a chance that was, and uh, I don't know whether he's going to get another in this match. Oxlade-Chamberlain. On to Roberto Firmino. Chance to get the ball in the box. And here's Elliot. Well, he used the inside of his head well, but not the outside, off target. Yeah, just slightly missed time, that one. Still time for... Mitrovic! Oh, what a good game this is, with this equalising goal. They've fought back to level it up once more. They'll be delighted with that. Well, that is a beautiful cross, and it's done justice with a firm, accurate header. Another angle on it here. Wow, that was the opportunity you thought when the attack shaped up to actually get the match winning. Obviously thought he'd really got to connect there, and he did, but maybe it just put his aim off. Yeah, I mean, a bit of contact maybe from the defender, but uh, you would have expected him to score from there. Well, after all the action, we're going to go to penalties. Now, the shootout. Well, he scored in the shootout. So next up to take the penalty. And they've got a good penalty taker in this fella. No nerves from him in this shootout. So it's his turn now from the spot. It's one of those that might fly over, but it didn't. Just under the bar and into the top corner. Didn't seem any doubt at all. 
it's time to step up. Oh, he's wasted it. Oh, you feel for him, but it wasn't a good effort at all. Oh, hats off to the keeper. Oh, brilliant stuff from him. Wasn't going to be foxed out. Up he comes. Well, he's up to the task with his penalty. Put the penalty away. And very confident he was. Here's the next penalty taker. That's a brilliant stop. So the spotlight turns to this player. Score, and they win. It's as simple as that. If only it was. Oh, he's kept it out. Ready to go. The next penalty taker. Somehow he saved it. Well, it's down to him now. If he scores, they win the game. Wonderful save. So next up to take the penalty. Excellent penalty. Not worrying at all about the pressures of the shootout. Well, the goalkeeper knows that if he can keep this one out, his side have won. But the penalty taker can keep his side in it by scoring. He had to score, and he has to bear the consequences of his side losing the shootout. Oh, look at him. You've got to feel sorry for him. Just something that happens to players once in a while in their careers. That's what can happen, Alan, when you put too much on it. It flew over the bar. Always looks bad, doesn't it, when you miss from 12 yards? And that certainly did look bad. Technique let him down there, over the bar. That narrow margin, a successful spot kick has been the determining factor in this result. Yep, and they converted it really confidently. In all honesty, they never looked back after that.